In today's lesson, we'll be learning about angle relationships in triangles. In this diagram of a triangle, two interior angles are labeled, as well as one exterior angle. We want to know if there is a relationship between these two interior angles and this one exterior angle. Take a minute to look at these numbers. After some time, you'll notice that the sum of these two interior angles is the exterior angle. We'll have to take a look at another triangle to see if this relationship is true. Again, you'll see that two interior angles are labeled as well as one exterior angle. What we noticed earlier does appear to be true here as well. The sum of the two interior angles is the exterior angle. We can now conclude that the exterior angle at each vertex is equal to the sum of the interior angles at the other two vertices. In other words, if you take these two interior angles and add them up, that should give you this exterior angle. Simply put, x plus y is equal to z. In our first example, we need to determine this unknown angle. Based on the relationship we just discovered, these two interior angles should add up to this unknown angle. We can represent this situation with an equation. 90 plus 60 is going to be equal to our unknown angle. We can simplify this equation by adding 90 and 60 together, which gives you 150. Therefore, the unknown angle is 150 degrees. In our second example, the unknown angle we're trying to find is actually over here. We can represent this situation with an equation whereby the two interior angles, when added up together, gives you the exterior angle. At this point, you want to identify like terms. 40 and 70 would be like terms. I'm going to move the 40 to the other side of the equation. When I do that, that 40 is no longer positive, it is now negative. We can simplify this equation. 70 subtract 40 is going to give you 30. Therefore, the unknown angle is 30 degrees. In our third example, we can see that two interior angles are given as expressions, while the exterior angle is not. We can still represent the situation with an equation. We know that the interior angles, when added up together, will give you this exterior angle. We can begin to solve this equation by simplifying the like terms on the left side. We know that 8x plus 7x gives you 15x. Now to solve the equation, we're going to divide both sides by 15. Those 15s are going to cancel out and that gives us a value of two. Therefore, x is equal to two. 